Howdy everybody. This is a, a, just a slight update. Um, <clears throat> there's still a few little minor things wrong mechanically with it. Um, it has a slight oil leak and uh, he said he thought he could probably fix it and he got under it yesterday and he cleaned off stuff and he said he tightened it a little bit more. Um, and he told me to keep an eye next time I park somewhere for a while just when I back up to see if there's any oil. And there's still an oil leak. Uh, I think it's a slower leak now. Um, but it's still there. So uh, whatever it is, I don't think it's been fixed yet. Uh, the other thing is it's squealing when I step on the gas. And uh, um, my son's roommate, I gave him a ride. He said it's probably a belt. So... I gotta talk to my neighbor about that. Um, but uh, today's Monday, and um, Wednesday I get some money again, so I've started a list. Where's my list? Oh heck, I don't have it up here. Where'd I put it? Thought it was up here. Nope. Okay. So on my list, I've got, I uh, want to get wipers, windshield wipers. I want to get the part that he said I would need to get the muffler more quiet because the muffler is a little bit loud, and he said that can be fixed with an $11 item. So we're going to fix that. He's going to take another look at it, I guess, once I tell him it's still leaking oil and uh, find out what that whining noise is, squealing noise. Um, he said something about, uh, the serpentine belt that was in here when we bought it was as bad as the one that was on it, but he did replace it with it, but it could be the serpentine belt, I don't know, but, um, I'll talk to him about it and buy what I need to buy Wednesday. Oh my God, one more day. It's been hot. It's been really hot. Um, evenings, uh, in the van have been a little bit uncomfortable. Um... But, I'm still happy that I'm here, so I'm not complaining too much, just a little bit, because it's hot. It's supposed to get cooler again today. Uh, if it gets down to, like, the high 60s even, it's, it's, it's better. But if it stays in the 70s, like last night, the low was 71, and it just isn't enough to cool off. I mean, I woke up and I wasn't sweating like a pig, but it didn't get down below 77 until way after midnight. So, uh, my thing's just coming off. I don't know why I try putting it on. When I have my hair in a bun or a ponytail, it doesn't stay. Okay. So, I'm hoping that the rest of this week uh, will stay in the at least the high 60s. Um, there's one day coming up that says it's going to get down to 58 or something, which is going to be heaven. Heaven. Because I'm not used to sweating like this, you know. But, uh, I'm surviving. And, uh, I made it through the month. So I'm happy. And I probably should keep my hand up here because the light's better. <laughs> Um, I'm going to add a little clip at the end to show you the swans, because I like the swans, but that's the update, um, and once I get those things done, we'll see how it does on, on driving. Uh, I did drive it for an hour, and I smelled rubber really strong when I got out. I gave somebody a ride to Carbondale, it was about an hour long, an hour and seven minutes or something like that. Um, so I'm not sure what that is, um, but, uh, we're getting it taken care of. It's all minor stuff, and, uh, like I said, I'm still really happy. I just, I sit in here, even if I'm sweating, and I think, man, this is my place. I can do whatever the heck I want. Nobody to tell me what to do, where to go, nothing. I love it. It's been a while since I've had that. So, I'm kind of happy. <laughs> and uh, I hope everybody's having a great 
week. You know, I did. I had my birthday, so I'm 67 now. And uh, I need to get going. Need to get going. But I'm anxious. I'm an anxious person. But we're going to do it. Okay, I'll keep you keep you updated and uh, take care. I love y'all. I'm up to, I think, 79, yeah, 79 subscribers, which is kind of cool. 79. I have no idea. Not a clue, but um, I, I like it. So, uh, everybody take care. Be good. Love you. Follow you, Bliss. Bye. I'm taking a chance. Usually they come over and chase people away on this bench. But I've been talking to them sweetly from the other side. Because I usually sit over there. So today I decided to sit over here and see if they come after me. The big one, which I thought was a male is a female and the little one is also a female someone told me that the male died several years ago and the few times that these lay eggs they take turns sitting on them of course they're not fertilized because there's no male so it's kind of sad and I'm thinking maybe the big one is the mother because she seems a lot more protective of the littler one. They're almost the same size, just a little bit of a difference in size. But um, so far, she's been over there for quite a while cleaning herself and she's not come over here to bug me. I can tell, I've noticed when they are curious and not wanting to hurt you, they keep their neck up and they walk around with their neck straight, but if she wants to scare someone away, she'll get her neck all bent down real low and come at you. So I'll have a little bit of warning on, <laughs> on uh, what kind of mood she's in if she comes this way. I'm just going to ignore her, unless I can't. And then I'll run. <laughs> I'll let you know if anything happens. I like to watch them clean themselves, though it's kind of pretty. Okay. So is she coming this way? I can't tell. I don't want to stare her down or anything. Some people walked by and she got all hissy with them. And all they did was walk by. <laughs> so we'll see what she does with me. So far so good. My neck's up. That's a good sign. That's a good sign. I whistle at them too all the time so they know who I am. Don't know if it makes a difference. But if next time you see me, I um, am missing a finger. <laughs> It may be because of that one right there. Because she is definitely temperamental. But I don't really care. I still think she's beautiful. She's not paying a lot of attention to me, so I'm just going to assume that I'm okay. <laughs> you know what they say about assuming, but we'll find out. Oh, what an angle. Look at all that hair. <laughs> I need to put it back a little more. Oh, well. Who am I trying to look pretty for besides you guys? <laughs> I'm 67 now. Isn't that exciting? There's the one still in the water cleaning itself. The other one, yeah. Yep. Going back to the water, it looks like. 
far out. I survived. I passed the test. She didn't mind me being here at all. Far out. Thank you, Mama.